this is the the behind the scenes y'all so i think I'll, I'll leave this here for now i think it's a good aesthetic you guys it's literally how everything is looking right now uh that is simply because uh I have a lot of stuff and I didn't pack it properly and I was looking for my clothes for the try and haul. I couldn't find them so I just started taking things out. Guys, so how do you mix your potato? I forgot. Do you boil it and then chop it? I don't know. Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. If you are new, welcome and please subscribe before you leave. You will not regret it. But if you're not new, welcome back. Um, I'm setting this video off here because I'm actually getting ready to do my makeup. I'm going to do my makeup right now and I'm watching some stand-up comedy. Guys, I love stand-up comedy. I'm watching some more. Um, I'm watching her latest stand-up comedy, The Rain Continues. Um, I'm doing my makeup because we're going to be filming um, a try-on haul. So one of the outfits is this one that I'm wearing right now. It is for Yellow Sub Trading. So it's a Marava Stuff store that I bought stuff from. I'm gonna show you guys what I got, if it fits well, what you should expect, all those things. So getting ready, doing like a simple makeup look. Just want to put some lashes on. Hopefully I can put my lashes on because today my lashes will wanna stick. My glue is jacked up. So basically I'll be doing my makeup and then I will see you guys when we start trying on these clothes and you guys will see the behind the scenes of how I prepare for my try on hauls and all that good stuff. So with my hair and my makeup, I think I want to change my hair up a bit. I feel like it's too formal, it's too bridal and I want it to be, you know, just street. Keep it a bit, you know. I don't know, but I think it's cute though. You guys, it's literally how everything is looking right now. Uh, that is simply because uh, I have a lot of stuff and I didn't pack it properly and I was looking for my clothes for the try and haul, I couldn't find them, so I just started taking things out because um, the sun is leaving, so I need light and I have to hurry up, so I have to repack this later. But this is basically behind the scenes of content creation. So you guys, these are the outfits that I got. It's a dress, the white dress that you will see in the video. I also have a jumper. It's like a bodysuit type of thing that I've got. And then I also have this dress that I love, but I think I spilled something on it and I have to rewash it. And then I also have the black version of it, which is this one right here. These are very much bodycon, body, like just bodycon dresses, like they're like everyday dresses. And this other one that's very colorful as well. So these are the ones that I'm gonna try on for you today. You guys will see how they look in the video. Um, right now they're on the couch and I think I should have ironed the white one But I was too lazy. So this is what's happening right now. This is like behind the scenes and my makeup bag is right there And we have the speaker in the background because when I get ready, I have my Speaker there and also I have my ring light to hold the phone. So we are gonna start filming pretty soon okay, So I'm about to set up because now we are gonna film my haul and I'm ready like my first outfit and I need to set up the couch to a point where the light can hit me properly and not uh, and not and not struggle with the light. I also have to take thumbnail pictures. It's a lot, you guys. Like content creation behind the scenes is a lot. So I'm gonna move this couch right now, and I'm gonna take a thumbnail. So I'm gonna move it to this side. Let me put you guys here so you can see what I'm doing. So I'm gonna move it to this side, and then you're gonna. This is the the behind the scenes, y'all. So I think I'll I'll leave this here for now. I think it's a good aesthetic. And then we're gonna take thumbnail pictures because we have to. So I'm gonna put you guys right here. And I'm gonna sit here. But now there's no light, so I can't even do that. But I'm gonna sit here and take a fish. I can't, guys. I really can't because there's no light. But to set up this because we are gonna take a thumbnail for this specific video. So I'm gonna just put this right here. Hopefully this works. Hey y'all, so I just got some food from the Checker 60 app. I just ordered like a few things for the week. Um, this is not a healthy meal prep. I'll tell you guys that much right now. 
there is no money for an all healthy meal prep this month, but we'll start next month, okay? Next month we'll do that. So basically, I've got a few things here that I'm gonna actually make. Some of it is just fruits. It's like maybe five items. I have some things like in the house as well. So we're gonna just make some food for the week. I'm gonna meal prep for the whole week because I don't have time during the week to cook. So I'm gonna just make uh, whatever I, I have in the house and what I've got. Okay, so we have some salted butter and also have some bananas right here and some plain yogurt. This is like breakfast stuff. Um, I also have some rice and muesli right here so this is like a vegan muesli type of thing we'll see what happens here so i'm gonna meal prep right now um when i start cooking i hopefully you guys can still see because it's thing is like the sun is going down and it's really hard to film at night because i have no lighting for the night time so hopefully i can start cooking right now i'm still actually if you see me like this all dressed like this because i was filming my trial haul and then I ordered food after that, so that's why I'm all dressed up and looking cute. Uh, yeah, so uh, we're gonna cook right now. I actually defrosted my mince, it's right here. I might make this with rice or I might make it with some spaghetti. I'm not really sure what I wanna do. Might make more vegetables, I haven't decided yet. But we're gonna just do that right now, and yeah, I will see you guys when I see you guys. that I just made some rice some broccoli and, and corn some spaghetti and some mint and my mint had so much oil but I left it in there because I know that when you warm it up it does help a little bit when you have some oil on your spaghetti because it's not too dry but that's what I'm gonna make I might make some meat in between the week but so far I have the basics and you guys um, welcome back to my channel if you are new please subscribe before you go but if you're not new if you're not new welcome back to my channel eh? welcome back so anyway um today is saturday and i just got back from china city and it was an epic fail when it comes to some of the things that i bought i'll show you guys later so um what am i shouting i don't know so anyway, welcome back to my channel as you can see there's a there's a new situation happening right now right it's like my bedding situation um this is supposed to be cute but it, it turned out horribly uh the size is wrong so i got a few things that i want us to unbox i got this thing right here this is um how do you call it the thing that you use to put your um your utensils in i don't know if you call it a utensils divider or what but i got this i like it because it's wood um i love the whole bohemian nature type of feel to it so it's this one i'm gonna put my stuff in here this was like 140 at china mall um it doesn't feel as strong but it but it's decent i'm gonna put it there in the kitchen so i've got this um and it's big so i like it i also got a chopping board because i am investing in cooking these days but also when i do my meal prep i want to at least have a chopping board because now I'm chopping on my plate and that's so popular. So I also got this. This was uh this was 40 bucks at China Mall. Let me show you guys what it looks like. Um that's what it looks like. Uh, I'm just taking this thing out. So I'm cutting it's a bamboo cutting board they say. That's what it looks like. And then I also got um I don't know why I love old school stuff. It comes to 
cup since that I bought this cup but I just felt like it can give me very much like um, Hansel and Gretel type of movie feel it gave me Harry Potter vibes like look at this it's very old school very vintagey but I like it so I got this cup for 30 rands um, it's supposed to be like my my mug for uh, coffee and stuff like that and then um, I also needed this set a bowl set because I'm always cooking and I always want to put my stuff in the fridge once I'm done cooking so I got a bowl set a bowl set a bowl, a bowl set uh, with 455 rand it's a glass set and it's red because they, they only have red yes, so this is it and this is what it looks like so we're gonna just try and open this so it's, it's how many one two it's about four of these yeah four of these depending on size we have the really small one and then we have a we have this one and then we also have this um yeah, and then we have these two big ones. We have this, and then we also have this one. So it's these ones. We're gonna put them in the in the cabinets too because I'm very they give me anxiety because like they're glass, so I'm gonna break them. And then I also got this thing for scrubbing the toilets. I also got this. This was I forgot how much this was. I think it was 85 rand. Uh, China more, so yeah. So this is what it looks like. I just need to remove the. This is it. So it's gonna go in the bathroom, which I'll go in the bathroom for when I put like when I throw things there. So this is gonna go in the bathroom. This will be very 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 useful uh, because I mean, come on, I'm gonna use this a lot. Makeup uh, sponges, I'm gonna have to sponge my makeup stuff. I'm taking off makeup and makeup wipes are gonna go there once I use them, you know. This is it. And then, um, I think the last thing that I got are these soap holders. I have different soaps in the bathroom because of my eczema. I have soaps for um, my skin, I also have my face, and also like soaps for my body. So, I got these two soap, soap holders, these two right here because I need to put them in separate uh, places. So I've got this, and yeah, that's pretty much it. I think we're gonna just pack these things away, and then we're gonna, uh, then I'm gonna order food, because there's food in the kitchen, like in the fridge, but I want chicken licking. I don't know, it's an addiction, you guys. I love it, love it, love it, love it. And I'm just craving something really, really meaty and salty. So we're gonna buy that right now, and then we're gonna see what happens.